What's going on guys? Welcome back to the Unturned Showcase Series where I show off some of the cool Unturned Workshop mods. Today, we're taking a look at Artifacts Domination Pack. This is a pack full of some sweet guns. I know we do a lot of these, but you know, people just keep coming out with cool stuff and so we're going to take a look at it. So this is the Ash 12.7. And it has a grip, a mag, and a suppressor as well. And so since this looks like we're probably going to go through this pretty quickly, let's go ahead and, and spawn another one in here. Uh, okay, so we've got auto, semi. Take a look at what semi is first. You know, the only issue, like I said in the last video that I did with the gun video, is that I don't know how many, like, how balanced these guns are. I don't know how, if they're just, like, one shot killing or what, like, what the deal is. Because, like, you don't want to, you don't want to have something where it's, like, super, super OP, and it's really easy to kill stuff with it. Pretty easy to control that. On the run. You go through, I can see you going through ammo pretty quickly with this thing, though. It's not like complete. Yeah, it's fairly accurate too. Okay, so that's the Ash, the Ash 12.7. Now we're gonna take a look at the MRC, which has got an urban camo. Three nine. There's a bunch of different ones. So there's this urban camo, and then there's also an olive camo. And then uh, I think that's it. We'll take a look at this one too and see what this looks like. So just a different color. I mean, it's pretty much the exact same look. And it's, I mean, it looks barely different though too, which is interesting. Holy crap! Probably can't do full auto with that thing. Oh, I like this gun. Seems pretty. Pretty OP. And this has uh, a 50 round mag with it as well. So like I said as always, if you guys are interested in getting these things for your map or something, you can go check it out in the community, uh, in the workshop and subscribe to it there. I do like the way that, I like the way a lot of these guns sound. I know you pull them from, I know these guys, holy crap, we need to spawn. Um. I know that you sp they sp like they use sounds from other games, obviously, but oh my gosh, that's incredible! Okay, so let's say MRC. Next up, we have what he calls the NTW twenty, um, and that is six zero four four. There's also an urban and a desert camo for this thing. What the heck is this? What the crap? Oh. oh my gosh! Goodness gracious, that thing. That is incredible! <clears throat> that sounds so freaking cool, man. It's a little weird with the sight, though. There's something weird about it. Look at the recoil on that thing. It's massive. Yeah, something weird with the sight on it. I don't know exactly what it is. Um, okay, so then we have the RSH 12.7 6052. Oh, nice. Look at this sweet-looking pistol, man. Holy crap, that thing looks amazing. The uh, detail on that. Wait, let's let's change it to day. There we go. Just keep it daytime as days we can. Oh, this is beautiful. Be beautiful. Thing is violent sounding. You know what I want to do? Um, there's a five round clip, and there's also a suppressor. <laughs> that sounds sweet. 
3053. There's also a suppressor for it, too. Oops. Oh. Get wrecked. Uh, before the reload even right there. Oh, let me let me do this. Let me do this right. Okay, so there's a, there is a suppressor, and there is also a barrel extender. So we can put on the extender or the suppressor. Oh my gosh! Look at that thing. That's amazing. It's so sweet. Okay, so there's a suppressor. So let's see what this sounds like with the suppressor on. That is sweet. That extender though looks so sick. Dang, that thing is awesome. Alright, so let's take a look at the PKP. Um, and there's also a 100 round box for it and a conversion kit what does that do? conversion kit oh is that like a wait you can use it to uh... oh okay so this changes it into like What? Do I have to have it? I have probably have to have it in my inventory, or out of, yeah, out of my hands. <clears throat> what the crap? Just gave it like a sight and stuff and a laser sight. I just shot through three things, right there. Two things. This is the most controlled. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is insane, man. That is interesting. People are getting kind of clever with these uh, kits and stuff now. I like them a lot. Alright, so the next thing is... This one... Oh, the, that's, that's a converted one, okay. Um, then we have the VSSK. What the heck, man? Oh, you know what? I knew it was this thing. Moment I, moment I looked at it. Red Chevron. That is really cool. So there's also a force camo one as well. For, okay, so for this next one. Um, wait. At teleport intact to summer. Okay. Because this is a Sega 12. Shell mode. Okay. Uh, oh, there's, there's shells and slugs. Interesting. Uh, let's get a 12 round drum for this thing. There we go. Gosh, dang that thing's loud. That is ridiculous. Okay, so that's a shell mode. There's also a <coughs> slug mode. And let's get the 12 round for that. This is, I would imagine this is gonna make a difference. Maybe. Maybe we can just shoot farther, I don't know. We can shoot pretty far away. Amy is messed up or something. Yeah, 
yeah, look at that, it's way off. I think that's probably what he talks about. He gives like a little disclaimer about it. Alright, is there anything else? Shotgun slug belt and a grip. No, that is it. Guys, thank you so much for watching this. This is a very interesting pack. I like that conversion kit thing. That was really cool. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, click that thumbs up button below. And if you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe. I'll see you guys next time.